Laura, Laura. I'm gonna watch Peaky Blender season 2 episode 4. Today maybe I'm gonna have time to watch more than one episode and it, make, it makes me really happy because like I said on the last reaction videos I lived a rough days <laughs> these days so I really need that, I really need this time to chill, to binge watch this show, to binge watch a show that I love, to, to be again on Picking Blinders, to, to see again those characters that I love so much. Yes, it makes me happy <laughs> when I'm here watching this show. I'm happy about that. I want that. I need them. I want to see what is gonna happen to those characters. Please, nothing wrong. Nothing bad. Please. I want all of them to be happy, to be alive. That's my main <laughs> preoccupation. I want them to be alive at the end of season 4. Please. <laughs> Can I have that? Don't spoil me on the comments. Don't put any spoilers on the comments, please. Uh, I'm stressed about that. When you are beach watching a show, it's really a temptation to look on Wikipedia or something like that to see what is gonna happen to the characters that you love. I didn't do it and I don't want to do it. I'm stressed about that. I want them to be alive at least at the end of the season 4 and happy if it's possible. I know uh, <laughs> I want a lot. I know it's a lot, but please can I have can I have that? Please it's a running gag. Tommy walking at the beginning of each episode, it's a running gag now. What do you want? It's enough. I'm in love. You answer to an agent of the crown. Obviously. Shut up. Stop laughing. You want me to stop laughing? Explain this part. Following the success of Shut up! Nobody is listening to you. No one in this room wants to breathe the same air as anyone else. For once you're right. What now? It's clever, it can be a real good ally for Tommy. I'm already proud of this family. Of you too. Uh, no, I don't think that. Oh, yes! You! I forgot. I might like a. <laughs> that was 
Once we end. In what way? The horse is why I'm here. Surely that. She has her own story, her own way to think about the things. So this is about fencing. Finn, every time that I see you, I'm really happy. You're the future of this family. I want you alive at the end of season four. What does it mean? I don't like that. How much time? You're making a good team, you too. <laughs> I love this family. <laughs> Welcome in the family. Can't be good for us, for the Chambies. Ah, that's it. Where are we? Buckingham Palace? You live here? Wow. There is a sexual tension right here. I'm not the only one who feel it. Well, I guess to say, we have a whole room for this room. Oh. It's real, but in a good way. Ils sont gênés, tous les deux. The two of them, they are broken. They can be good for each other, I think. That's a relationship that is not built on something wrong and bullshit. That's a relationship that is well written. That is a real relationship with people who are not lying to each other, who are telling all the truth. Grace? I choose myself, obviously. 
Nobody asks you to do that. You can leave. Fuck you. Thanks your dad. You deserve that. What? This is her? Hello? This is her husband? Grace? I'm sorry, but they are making all the bad choices, all the wrong choices, I mean the writers, we can't like Grace with the choices that they made. How can we? In season 1, she was a spy, she was lying to the Chelby's brothers, she was a problem and an issue for them and now in season 2 for 4 episodes she was on the background we, we knew that she was gonna come again but it was annoying, really annoying they made us love this new girl love May because she is not lying, she is honest with uh, Tommy, she can be good with him because she is as broken as him and now she's back like just like that with her husband she's ju she just sent a telegram to Tommy to tell him she is uh, in town Fuck you! You're not good for him I really don't like her. You can see it in my face. I'm sorry, but I don't like her, and the, and the writers are making all the bad, bad choices, all the wrong choices to make me love her. I can't love her with their choices of writing her, of writing what she did, of writing their relationship. It means that on the two other episodes of the, this season we're gonna have Tommy meeting with Grace uh, breaking up with her husband choosing Tommy's side I'm as annoyed by her and her storyline that I am annoyed by this dog my neighbor's dog, I can mm, 
it's all the day like that. I'm really not happy with that. Okay. So I'm gonna have to deal with that on the next episode. The return of grace. Okay. About this episode, it was really good to see Tommy with uh, um, a woman that don't like to him, that doesn't like to him. It was really nice to see Michael um, being a part of this new family. Now the Sabini are working with uh, the Solomons it can't be good uh, for the Chelbys maybe in, on the next episode they're gonna fight it's gonna be hard for the Chelbys I don't want that Arthur oof, is going on the wrong way Willy is going on the wrong side of the force. I'm not sure he can came back. He can't come back from that. We'll see. Okay, so it's all for me and it's all for now. So bye for now. Bye.